Fluorescent chloride sensors are used for chemical analysis. The discoveries of chloride Cl participations in physiological processes stimulates the measurements of intracellular Cl in live cells and the development of fluorescent tools referred below. <laughs> Quinoline based dyes Quinolinium based Cl indicators are based on the capability of halides to quench the fluorescence of heterocyclic organic compounds with quaternary nitrogen. Fluorescence is quenched by a collision mechanism with a linear Stern Volma relationship F0 F equals 1 plus K C L Minus display style frac f underscore zero f equals one plus k c l carrot where f zero display style f underscore zero is the fluorescence in the absence of halide f display style f is the fluorescence in the presence of halide k display style k is the stern volma quenching constant which depends on the chloride concentration c l minus display style cl caret in a linear manner thus quinoline based indicators are one wavelength dyes the signal results from monitoring the fluorescence at a single wavelength ratiometric measurement of halide concentration is not possible with quinolinium dyes the kinetics of collision quenching are diffusion limited only, and these indicators provide submillisecond time resolution. Quinolinium based dyes are insensitive to physiological changes in pH, but they are prone to strong bleaching and demand ultraviolet excitation, which is harmful for living organisms. Because quinolinium is not occurring in the cells naturally, cell loading is necessary. However, quinolinium-based dyes aren't retained perfectly in the cell and can't be targeted easily to subcellular organelles. Also, they cannot be designed specific to a certain type of cell. The most used quinolinium-based Cl- indicators are 6-methoxy-1 3-sulfonatopropyl quinolinium SPQ, 6-methoxy N-ethylquinolium Cl- MEQ, and N 6-methoxy quinolil acetoethyl ester MQAE. YFP-based Cl- sensors Cl- indicators can be designed on the basis of endogenously expressed fluorescent proteins such as yellow fluorescent protein An advantage of endogenously expressed probes over dye-based probes is their ability to achieve cell type specificity by the choice of promoter underscore genetics promoter. YFP-based indicators are mutated forms of green fluorescent protein GFP. YFP contains four-point mutations and has a red-shifted excitation and emission spectrum compared with GFP. YFP fluorescence is sensitive to various small anions with relative potencies iodine greater than nitrate greater than chloride greater than bromide greater than formate greater than acetate. YFP sensitivity to these small anions results from ground state binding near the chromophore, which apparently alters the chromophore ionization constant and hence the fluorescence emission. The fluorescence of YFP is sensitive to Cl- and pH. The effect is fully reversible. YFP is excited at visible range and is a genetically encoded probe. YFP-based Cl- sensors have rather low kinetics of Cl- association, dissociation. The half-time association, dissociation constants for YFP mutant range from 50 ms to 2 seconds if a fluorescent indicators is based on one fluorescent protein only, it doesn't allow for ratiometric measurements. Hence, a rationale for ratiometric fluorescent indicators results. Topic: 
FRET-based, genetically encoded CL- indicators Forster Resonance Energy Transfer based CL indicators consist of two fluorescent proteins, cyan fluorescent protein and YFP connected via a polypeptide linker. This allows ratiometric CL- measurements based on the CL- sensitivity of YFP and CL- insensitivity of CFP. Clomelian and CL- sensor are FRET-based CL indicators that allow ratiometric non-invasive monitoring of chloride activity in living cells. <laughs> Notes <laughs>